what's up? It's your boy King J Wings here today, and I'm gonna be doing a mukbang about energy, your energy, and you know what I'm gonna be eating today is right here a large custom Papa John. No sponsorship, please sponsor me. Uh, pineapple sausage and chicken no I ain't gonna lie I'm trying to really violate this real quick hold up mmm I need to play some music So today, I'm sorry. Not sorry. Me da, me da, ain't no little step. Y'all know that song. Ain't no little step. Ain't no little me da, me da. I think, bro. I never knew Drake could like. Sing in Spanish, like that's kind of hard to do, you know. I know y'all can't hear the song right now, but my neighbor is playing it. I can hear it though. So, protecting your energy, right? We're gonna start off with your energy and like what it is. Now, I haven't done a lot of research about it, but I have a good idea of what it is. And your energy is your soul, like your your embodiment of how you feel. You know, your brain is a lot to do with it. Your brain is so powerful. A lot of people overlook it. And protecting your energy is very important. Now, your energy um, is your day-to-day, -day, like, basis of how you feel, like, you wake up happy, you wake up sad, you wake up angry, you know, and, you know, a lot of it, like, if you wake up angry, it could be the, the lack of energy, where your energy is being stolen. Now, I say this because, um, many people, they have a lot of, uh, friends or people, acquaintances that they interact with to a daily daily basis and you know they never realized that okay maybe this person is per se uh stealing your energy now this doesn't make that person a bad person this could be your fault too you could just be giving energy to that person you know and that's your choice but you you probably may feel good at the time and then later on you notice oh shoot you have no energy left for the rest of the day. Now, um, I'm not going through this right now, but I used to, and I'm using this to help like everyone that sees this video right now. So you can know, maybe if you're going through something like this, I can help you out. As a viewer, you know, I, I appreciate you for clicking on this video and respecting me enough and giving me time to uh, be able to explain myself to you. Um, now don't worry, I'm gonna body this later. I'm gonna body some of this, I'm gonna body some more of it. But, uh, I just wanna start off with, I'm gonna try to stay like on one top, like slowly transition to many topics. So we have, uh, um, for example, this is, I'm gonna say like from what I know. So, uh, your energy is something you use to put into your goals and what you like 
and without energy it's very hard to be there being able to stay on track with whatever you do to a daily daily basis for example um so let's just say i like to draw right but at the moment i don't really have any energy for for drawing as much as i used to because i'm putting a lot of energy into youtube putting a lot of energy into uh um yeah let's yeah youtube and work so when you put a lot of when i put a lot of energy into work and youtube there's like a lack of time and energy left for that uh specific thing now a human being now we have a lot of limits but sometimes you'd be surprised what you're capable of doing now um people usually say not to overwork yourself but you have to understand that if you schedule everything right then it's pretty much possible to do everything that you would like to do you just might not be able to put enough time to where you can be the best in your competition now going to um people itself now uh, people, human beings in general are always uh, energy consumers. You know, we feed off each other's energy. That's how we live. That's why. Uh, that's why we always seek relationships. That's why women seek men, men seek women. Yada 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 yada. All right. It's just what humans do. We were created this way to to interact and observe and consume information and give information. Now some people are programmed to where they only only consume mostly. They may give energy here and there. But sometimes they're programmed to where they only can consume the energy. Now, that can be because that's just the way they grew up. That can be because that's the environment. Like, there's so many things that incorporate with that theme. Alright? Now, what happens with people like that is... You know, if you're always around people like that, what happens is your mind, you kind of get a uh, condition. I didn't want to figure that out. Know? You sort of get conditioned to where you feel like you've been always like giving them energy, giving them energy, right? But later on, later on, you feel it. You start to realize that, okay, wow, I'm getting... I'm getting exhausted and you're getting exhausted it's only natural for you to get exhausted because your brain is it's a muscle you know and overusing it leads to exhaustion mental exhaustion and what happens if you have you don't really have as much energy left for things that you like to do because you're spending so much time with people that are so used to consuming energy and not giving much back to where uh, you're just left dried out and it's only natural. You're like a raisin in the sun, in the basket. All right, you know? And, you know, people like that exist for many reasons. And I appreciate people like that because it creates learning curves in your life to where, okay, it's time to make a change. You have to do this, you have to do that, you know? And, you know, you shouldn't hate people like this. You should, um, not acknowledge, but you should, like, you should at least know, okay, this person like this, and that's it, and you leave them be. Because... You're just only like wasting your energy and you need you're gonna need 
especially in, in that there's gonna be many times in your life where you really need to hustle on becoming your best you or true you or finding out what you need in life now if you if, if you hang on keep hanging out with people like that now you know your energy is gonna keep getting stolen what are you how are you gonna become your best self if your energy if you have no energy left for you to to master your, your true you you know so and speaking about mastering your true you uh we're gonna say that for an, a next video for now we're just speaking about energy this is fire bro this is, I feel this is like a new, a new like uh, art style. Just when you thought our pizza couldn't get any better, this isn't just stuffed crust. This is a Papa John's crust, stuffed. New. I didn't even get that, but you know, the box was fire though. Nice promo. Also remember, also always remember this, right? People that that um, give you little energy but consume a lot of yours, always remember. There's someone else that's getting way more energy than you're receiving. And they're getting replenished from that while they're giving them some energy back. And you know, try to find someone that can refill you. Like, there's people out there that can literally, you speak to them, they speak to you, they help you out, you help them out. You know, we need that. We need a lot of this. We need a lot of energy flowing in, energy flowing in, boom. Okay, you take that energy, okay. He's down there, boom. Okay, you took the energy. He's down here. Boom. We don't. We don't want. We don't want. Boom. Okay, he's eating. He's eating. He's eating. He's eating. He's receiving. 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 Oh, he gives a little back. Receiving. 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 He gives a little back. Receiving. 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 It's like, and this is like a whole giant climax. Boom. There's no energy to, to keep you stabilized, bro. So, I just want to end it here. Maybe this is like a part one. Take care of your mental. Stay safe. Stay energized. And find people who genuinely want to be around you. Because, you know, when you find people like that, it's, it's going to be really good for the long run. Especially mentally. Because your mental is ten times more important than your physical but then again i can't it is though but then again like yeah i don't even want to get into that but yeah it is it is it is let's see your mental is really powerful bro. so i hope you enjoyed the video like comment subscribe and stay tuned for more king j wigs out i was in a club they see me in the pub anyway She saw me like a beacon Brighter than a light